we're good to go, I hope, maybe. Uh-oh, why isn't the, uh, why is it, okay. Oh, for what I went through today, I do not want to have any more technical difficulties. As a matter of fact, my volume is low. Give me one second here, I'll fix it. Probably something to do with uh, the mic sensitivity. I have news, and it's in regards to the current, uh, current shenanigans that is the, the technical difficulties. Oh yeah, my mic is super low. All right, we're raising up. All right. We should be good now. I mean, we better be freaking good. Okay. So, sorry about that. Um, so, news. Uh, remember how I was saying that uh, uh, I like uh, USPS? Because they, they've been good to me. Uh, they've been extra good to me today. Because my um, my new RAM card came in today. And so, uh, hopefully, we have better experience. Have I fallen down a well? The technical get little fuck you. Uh, okay, so we're working with two RAM cards now. And, um, and a whole degree of headache. Because uh, I, I gotta get into the story. Because this is a fucking challenge here. I get my RAM card. Super happy. Go to install it. I turn my, my computer on and it just boots normally. Like, okay. Everything seems fine. I go to check. And it's not reading the RAM card. What the fuck is this? So, I check. And, um, you know, dumbass over here. Didn't decide to uh, double check to see if the RAM card was even plugged in all the way. So, I fixed it. Put the RAM card all the way in. Turn on my computer. And, uh, I gotta check some error. Like, my computer would not boot. I thought I broke my computer. And after about maybe 30 minutes of finagling with that, I'm like, okay, I'm just going to take it out. So I take it out, boot it with the one, the original RAM card. Worked just fine. What the fuck is this? So I call my buddy up, and he goes, hey, uh, did you overclock your original RAM? Oh. So went to put my first RAM settings back to default, and now we're fine. Everything's good. So, that was my day today. Oh, God damn! So, we got some updates. Uh, I installed uh, the the new version of Stardew Valley Expanded. And I also installed uh, Grampleton Fields. So, um, we're going to check out both those. Now just gotta. All right, that's my inventory. All right, we're fine. Everything's fine. Just kidding. It's not fine. None of this is fine. I gotta see how Monster Hunter World now runs with uh with, with the new Ram Garden. That's why I don't touch the innards. Yeah, that that's exactly why I don't touch the innards because I I know what sort of shenanigans can happen. So the solution was you turning it on and off. No. No, it was a lot deeper than that, and a lot more I want to kill myself than that. Um, okay, so the new stuff. New stuff has to do with the secret woods. I was hoping maybe Castletown would, uh, I could visit it finally. Apparently, that is not going to be the case this go around. Uh, okay, I also got a text message. Uh-oh. I, I invited a friend of mine to hop onto the stream. And she's like the exact opposite of me. And uh, no, she's she's going to take a nap. Okay, so she'll she'll get to see this afterward. Then and she gets she'll know the know the torture I'm going through. Um, but uh, what's it? Uh, why was there a, a random metal block in my house? Oh, God, now I gotta go check. Oh, is he talking about that pedestal? Because if he's ta talking about the pedestal, then that that's supposed to be there. And it's not decoration, or I don't call it decoration. Corrine calls it decoration. It was her idea, not mine. So, um, again, new stuff. Uh, we now have a direct route from the Immersion Farm to in into the Secret Woods. And the Secret Woods have been expanded upon. So, I have not checked to see what's in here. 
But already I'm confused. What is going on? Oh god, there's so many slimes. Okay, and a just random horseradish right there. Now, according to... I, th I think his name is pronounced Flash Shifter. Uh, you're supposed to... Um, uh, or he recommends uh, installing a mod that lets you reset terrain features. Otherwise, you, you might have difficulties getting through here. Oh. Hello. R okay, I could just walk over it. Alright, I think that might be a bug. One more reason to force the witch in all my experience of true joy with Lance. God damn. Oh, you have a fetish for Lance. And it it, dis it concerns me. I wouldn't say it disturbs, but it is kind of disturbing. Alright, where? Alright, I... Alright, my, my destroy bushes mod is not working. And, um... I don't think, uh... I don't think I can get, uh, get up over there. I, I think, uh... I think the secret wood is is broken for me now. <laughs> That's always fun. I think you might have wanted to make it a little bit more challenging to to get over to the Grandmaster. Oh, here we go. And well, I already have the st the star drop, so that was completely pointless. Well, I got a rare seed for my trouble. Alright. Uh, oh, also some new stuff in here. Uh, new forgeables. And uh, from what I'm seeing, a lot more stumps. And a lot more slimes. Which I'm not really a fan of. Alright, so... Yeah, let's expand it a bit. Hey, wait. Where's the, uh, where's the pond at? The lake. I guess it's this. Oh, I, I think that was one of the new forgeables I destroyed. It's a green fl flower. Completely missed it. Okay. What is it? What do we got up here? All right. Looks like a whole lot of nothing. And down over here. Oh, what is this? You just find a dozen <laughs> marble pillars on the floor. Yeah. No, someone forgot to pick up their Jenga pieces. Wait, I'm not in, like, the western forest area, am I? I am. Okay, this is just a shortcut to the to the big forest area. Aw, oh, that's, that's disappointing. I thought there might be some more content here. Alright, getting on the tractor... And uh, we're just gonna take a little peek around. Actually, let me get up. Um, I'm gonna get up the mod page and uh, see see what we got. All right, come on, come on, Chrome. All right, so go Stardew Valley expanded. Click. And then just take a little look at the change logs. Alright, come on. Expand. Okay. Well, apparently the void eel, eel is no longer available in the mutant bug layer. Let's see... So looks like a lot of uh, issue fix. Oh, okay. I downloaded, like, the newest, newest version. All right. Expanded the secret woods. All right. It's recommended players use pre-existing... Recommended players with pre-existing saves to use reset terrain features to reset the bushes in the woods. Easier said than done. 13 new forageables, 4 new fish, 2 new crops, 2 new consumables sold at Harvey's Clinic. I like that because Harvey's Clinic is severely lacking. All right, uh, more expressions for Scarlet, which is nice. There was uh, also the uh, shortcut in the Immersive Farm 2 Remastered, leading to Secret Woods, went there. Uh, added a new letter containing a fun decorative object players receive after earning 10 million gold. It's a lot of gold. 
added a new cat statue at the Calico Desert Club. All right, I assume that's... Um, I don't think I've done that quest line yet. What the hell is this? Shrub seed. Interesting. All right. Aside from that, it's uh, mostly just a lot of tweaks. Uh, but the mermaid's bracelet is now wearable, so that's that's pretty cool. Okay, so probably not as much as I had hoped for, but I also installed the Grampleton Fields, which is an optional file that uh, you can install. It, it's all it is is just this big open th field of nothing. Does this mean you can have your own water bush? I, I guess. I would I would say so. All right, we're going to go over to Grampleton Fields because I want to check this place out and from like the basic uh, uh, screenshots I've seen. It looks pretty big. I need to see just how big this place is. Oh, geez. All right, this is looking pretty big already. There's a whole lot of nothing here, uh, apart from, like, a tower that has no one in it. It's supposed to be a wizard tower. How, how far out does this go? Like, it's recommended that you have a, a decent graphics card for this, because it's, it, it'll take a pretty heavy toll. By appointment only. Oh, there, there's a warp pad over here. Can I... Oh. Where does this go? <laughs> Straight back to the wizard. That's pretty cool. Completely unhelpful, but it's pretty cool. Alright, let's uh, go back and uh, take another look here. There's supposed to be train tracks at the top. I mean, this, I mean, this is supposed to be part of Grampleton, but as I understand it... Oh, there's the end. They can't get go beyond this. The The fields will not let me. I'm being... I'm being blocked. Oh. I'm a train. This should lead all the way back to... Oh, it leads over to here. Okay. Oh, will this... Will this take me to Grampleton? It does. It takes you right to Grampleton. Well, let's see if Scarlet's home. Oh, wait, no. This isn't Grampleton. This, this is back. Okay, this is back at the regular train station. God damn it. Or oh, wait a minute. Wait a darn minute here. That doesn't seem right. Okay, there we are. Well, now we're in Grampleton proper. And I think um, Scarlet's dads uh, have portraits now? I think? Maybe? Let's see. Nope. Oh. Say hi to Scarlet. No, I don't think she has any more. I think her shirt color might have changed. But aside from that. Let's um, do the that one quest line. If it has not been done already. I need to check. Because I don't know. Alright, where is it? Get, a, get that battery pack. I love you, Magic Tractor. You're like a horse. If a horse had an engine stuck up its butt. Oh, what? I can't bring it in here?
Bring a rainbow sh shell to the train platform. Okay. I think I have a rainbow shell. It'd be in here? No, not in there. Maybe I put it in here? Alright, not sinking in there. Wow, all these I need to get rid of these forgeables. They are just the worthless. What is this? Okay. Uh maybe be in one of the forgeable chests? Oh. Or, how did I read two instead of one there? Ten beats. Gotta go put them in the, uh, in the mayor's fridge. But, uh, that also requires me getting beats. Alright. And, unfortunately, tomorrow is the egg festival. And, uh, I think Queen's gonna make me do the egg festival. I think she got a little mad that I skipped it last time. Because, egg. Uh oh, where's Kareen? She better not be in the walls again. It's really awkward. Um, I'm there. Right there. And wherever the hell this is. What's this? Oh, hello! Oh, it's from Mr. Key! That 10 million gold. Good work, kid. You have a bright future ahead. Okay, so it's accumulated. It is a golden piggy bank. That is... That is funny. That is really funny. I'm all for it. Might need to... Might need to make a new shed that is dedicated to Mr. Krabs and then just put this in the center of it. Wait, does it do anything? <laughs> oh shit, I'm losing money <laughs> I'm putting money in it Wait, can I get the money back? I mean, it won't let me do anything But put money into it That is dirty That is de I definitely have to make it Mr. Krabs Shed now That in there, that in there. Pretend that I care about these pigs. Your glorious savior, damn it, queen. Oh, you concern me so much. What is it? okay? That's just part of the uh, part of the tapper. I was building one already. I'm just going to wait for town to open up. God, town takes forever. Why is it that I'm the only one that's not allowed to head into town before the festival? 
This ain't cool. This ain't fun. I don't like this. Hey, you know what? I'm gonna buy an entire stack of strawberries from you. Because why not? Alright, a decorative pitchfork. Well, when people start realizing how bad Mayor Lewis is, that pitchfork is not going to become a decoration for very long. All right, where is... Oh, there's Lewis. All right, we're ready for the egg festival. Oh, that's right. I need to talk to Luna again. Cuz I got to I got to woo her. I don't want to. The highlight for the festivities. Yeah. All right. I'm going to try my normal route. All right, looking for eggs. I see an egg. Can I get behind here? Yes. Oh, there's another egg. I need, what, nine to win? I wish my coffee would carry over into this. Make my life so much easier. So much nicer. Leave these kids in the what? J Vincent, phasing through stuff. Oh, I see an egg, that's uh, over in the corner there. I don't think I can get to it in time. Nope. I can get this egg though. How do I even get behind there? Ah. Achieve victory, assert your dominance. Unfortunately, because I have the Maru expanded mod in, I, th I think she wins if uh, you get less than nine. Let's find out. I'm at eight. Alright, who is it? Damn it, Maru! N needs to be another mod that has more people competing. I, I think, uh, over here, I think this might be an egg right here. I think. Ah, restart. No, we're not restarting. Mulligan. <laughs> no, I'm a good sport. Well, I, I think the objective is to acquire egg, and I think we did that. In fact, everyone acquired egg. I don't think you could get much better than that. All right, Corrine's outside. Or she's phased into a wall again. Who knows? We must achieve victory at any cost. <laughs> oh, you worry me. Oh, that's right. I'm growing cauliflower. Wait, you watered the crops? No. You didn't really have to. I mean, I know Kareen over here overachieved her. Okay. Oh! Forgot the next objective. 
And that is to shove pr prismatic shards down <laughs> Luna's throat until she likes us enough to take us to um, uh, to where she's from. All right, let's a fan fiction begin. We failed. <laughs> God damn, Queen, being all melodramatic over here. I don't. I don't even know where this egg thing came from. <laughs> I really don't. If I ever sell merch, it's just we're just. There's gonna be an an egg shirt. She wants to guard me as I sleep in the wilderness? Okay, girl, you s you scare me. I am nothing if not overly dramatic. <laughs> oh hell. Okay, we gotta get over to... Uh, we gotta get to Calico Desert. And uh, also, the, uh, part of the update is an adjustment to Sally's vanilla portrait. So, I don't know if the default configuration is back to her original portrait or if it's still keeping the normal Stardew Valley expanded. Do I not have the key? I have the, the key to the valley. Let me in. All right, we got to wait a minute. And while that goes off, I will I'll just send a message to, to my buddy. Okay. Hey, 9 a.m. Yes, I'm burnt. Okay, she she keeps her expanded portrait, so that's cool. And I guess if you want the option, you can always change it back. So, nice. All right, we have acquired beats, and now to go pay a visit to, you know, the everyone's favorite con artist. Yeah, the key to Stardew, not everything else, sadly. This is unacceptable. Alright, get kicked down Piero's door. Give me that speed grow. Oh, the beats are made by Dre. <laughs> yeah, and they cost four hundred dollars. Oh, did I get the rest of the of these? I did not. I need just one. I think, right? Okay, yeah, right. I also need to check that cave to see any if any more prismatic shards show up. Does it need to be 10 beats or 10 beats of one type? The game could get a little bit picky about that. Hmm. I don't know. Hey! Prismatic shard! Alright, just one. That's okay. Oh, there's another one! Oh, just one. Alright, that's still a pretty good haul. Grab the rest of these. I have so many geodes. All right, and I think. 
think that's all I could do for today. Okay, I think, uh, oh, I should probably grab the truffles. Alright, give me your sacrifices. take produce items of any quality for a quest. Uh, I believe there was one or two instances where you had to have a specific amount of a type of item. Like the quality did matter. Um, I, I just can't remember what exactly that item was. And uh, there was something else I was doing. Oh! It's getting wood and stone. Ah, screw it. I'll just bring the entire stack. Why not? Yeah, I'll bring that too. There's a truffle next to the bottom of the fence. Okay. I will pretend to go get it. All right, Robin, I got a job for you. I think you mean the community quests. Uh, no, the only issue I have with the community quests is that, uh, like, if you already have the materials, it still doesn't. You still have to go out and get new materials. I mean, I get it's for the extra challenge, but if I have the materials already, come on, why not? Why not just use those? It's literally the same thing. Mm. Oh, that's right. In game tomorrow is going to be Monday. That means there's going to be a lot to do. Oh, not this chest. These chests. You think the community quests? No, you don't. I'm talking about the I'm talking about the community center. Ah, okay, the community center quests. Uh, yes, I do know that certain one of those ha do ha have to have specific qualities, but um, I believe it was a delivery quest, is what I'm thinking of. Alright, so kids' room is done. Um, I love having a coffee machine. Love that it's this close to me. Problem is, is that aesthetically speaking, it, it doesn't fit. Um, I'm trying to think here. Kind of put into the bedroom and make it more bedroom ear. Now we need a dresser, and I'm thinking mahogany is going to be the way to go. Uh, okay, those are paintings. Monster rug, nah. Red cottage, no. Bone rug, that does not look like a... Oh, I could see a bone, but very, very faintly. Ah. It's 
go with a modern rug. See how that works. And, of course, we're going to need a lantern of some kind, or like a light source. I'm going to go with two country lamps, see how that works. The kids can have the, the expensive ornate lance, uh, uh, lamp that they're eventually going to gonna break. China cabinet, uh, that's more for a uh, luxury bookcase, no, dark bookcase, nah, that's too edgy. Elegant fireplace, nah. Alright, we're going to go with the luxury bookcase. Probably two of these. That That's a pretty big bedroom. Should be more to, to fill it. Oh. Huh, a stump seat. I don't remember seeing that. And probably a small table. Nothing... Nothing huge. Okay, yeah, those are too big. Alright, these ones up right here. Wait, how big is the modern rug? Oh, that's pretty big. Furniture can't be placed here. Well, why the hell not? Now it could be placed there. This game and its loopholes, I swear. Alright, couple country lamps. Got this mahogany dresser. Put that right there. Probably need something needs to go on it. Maybe like a ship. Oh yeah, this table's a little too big for my liking. I'll try to fit it in. And bookcases. Gotta have bookcases. And they're not gonna fit in the places I want them to fit. Well, shit. Placing the second rug is a Reverse table trop top trick. What? Wait, can I? No. Can only go right there. I guess this can't go right there because of this. This. All right, we don't really even need that anymore. Oh, I really want to keep my coffee machine in here. How long have you been there? My kids are weird. Oh, wow. They're uh, actually walking normally. Oh, damn it! Uh, I had it on the rug this entire time. Alright, let's fix this. That I do find that annoying. I'm just... Oh, I had to pick this up too. Okay. Alright. Just breathe. Breathe. We could freak out later. Well, you'd think that the game would allow you to put the automatically put the rug underneath the bed. Because logically speaking that would make that would make sense. That like it would just uh, gives you the option of just automatically putting it under underneath the bed 
But nope. Game has to make you work for it. I wish I could turn these around. Animal Crossing physics. Yeah, that'd be nice. Um, you know what? We're just we'll just go with the one book um bookcase then. It's called layering you go Oh shush. Over here taking Queen's abuse. Alright, and next thing is I gotta change the gotta change the flooring. Gotta make it look nicer. I want them to be cushiony. And, well, there's not a whole lot of options for that from the looks of it here. I'll try this. And... Let's see, not that. Not that. Uh, let's try this. Can I make, uh, what am I making walnut? Hmm. Kind of like this and I kind of don't. Uh, I'm, th I'm thinking, I'm thinking the wallpaper. Wallpaper needs to change. Doesn't need any, be, be anything, uh, super fancy. But, uh, try this. You could be flung into the void, though. What? The wall on the floor. Walnut, wall on the floor. Um, I w I'm thinking more of a soft flooring design. Nothing like tile or anything like that. I mean, there's this, but it's, uh, it's wood and everything else is wood. No, definitely not that. Alright, I'm thinking about that light one. That, that lighter wallpaper. The one that looks like it's ornate, but it's a little bit lighter. Right there. Oh, actually, I'm going to get a few versions of that since I want to... I want to change the, the little hallway floorings, too. Which I, I find kind of dumb that those uh, have to have their own installed... All right, one right there, one right there, and then get three floorings. I think it was this one. Yeah. That looks nice. Can I, wait, what is... Um, I, I'm not really big on furniture stuff and all that. Uh, what is a nublet? We talk about these right here? The little nubbin. Ah, oh, you confuse me. 
the bit, the, the thing. What the hell are you talking about? The hall. I can word, but not to take. <laughs> I hope there's a dewdrop berry. I I need speed. Oh, there is. It is time for cocaine. All right, I'm gonna visit Luna first, and then we're gonna go in and grab all the things. Oh, I forgot, I need to go to Sophia's place. We'll do that too. All right, still at eight. Now she's at nine. Uh oh. She's getting flirtatious, so we're gonna Ed, Ed, and Eddie our way out of here. Oh, you know what? Screw it. I'm in a hurry! Beep, beep. I don't think they saw anything. All right, I just need one. Sorry, Sophia. Alright, gimme. I'm gonna have to put my, my range on max. Oh, actually. <laughs> Can't let it go to waste. Press a button, and I'm like, okay, what did I just do? All right, we're actually switch that, put that back there. Okay. Oh, look at all those, those beautiful ancient fruit. All right, seven twenty. Today's going to be a nice payday. I can't imagine they heard something, though. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, I think the thing that the people heard was the Lorax crying. Maybe. I don't know. Also, I need to hold off on making new kegs since I don't have the uh, I don't have the ancient fruit to really fill them at the moment. But that will all be changing. As when we have um, we have the farm on Ginger Island, and we have the the uh, the, the abandoned greenhouse. And then eventually we can convert the, the community greenhouse in Ridgeside to the house even more. <laughs> you 
You don't hold the... Uh, that's because it's uh, a little bit slower. Like, I would love to, but the the game can't process... Uh, a free, uh, I can't word either today. It can't process two commands at the exact same time. So, I can... Um, I could go through here with an ancient fruit, but I would have to make several passes in order to get the... Um, uh, all the kegs filled up. No, this is actually f more efficient than you think. So I have to go through every single one of these two times. It's, it's literally the fastest way I, I've been able to find. No, that's what I'm saying. If I have an ancient fruit in hand, and then uh, I'm trying to get the wine out, and I make sure to um, to have the ancient fruit put in as I'm taking the wine out, it slows me down. So I know it doesn't look ideal, but uh oh, I clicked out of the game. But uh, it's I I find it faster. Oh, I forgot to put the uh, the nozzle on. Damn it. I mean, probably next week I could tr try your your method, like next week in game if we get the, get that far obviously. But for the time being, this I find this a, a lot faster. Yeah, gotta get that nozzle on. I have a feeling I missed one. That's all of them. Right, throw the wine in, the rest of the fruit in. I'd be interested to see if there's an actual difference in time. Yeah, because now I want to know. Get the one nozzle on the wall. Last one at the top. To be fair, one OCD versus another is kind of subjective. I mean, the valid point. Oh shit! God damn it! <laughs> I cannot wait for the golden clock. How are things looking here? I have no idea what their their growth time is right now. Put the leftover fruit in the sh shipping bin. Well. Eventually, I'm gonna I'm I'm going to meet that that exponential threshold, and I'm just not gonna uh, I'm just not gonna have enough. So I'm gonna plan for the future. Let me also see how much uh, resources I have for more kegs. I 
part scares me. Waste a lot of money on. Okay, let's see. Well, I I basically have full stacks. Oh, queen. I like how Queen's always questioning my, my madness. It's quaint, in a way. You wonder why I have no soul left? I, I assume I'm going to be the one to blame for that. I just I took a tiny pickaxe and just started you know, scraping away at it a little at a time. All right, what was it doing? Oh, stone. I need stone. Actually, I think I'm gonna make dirt paths. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll find out. Otherwise, we would live in a world with nothing but entropy? What, the world's gonna fall apart? Okay. How do I want to do this? I think I'm just gonna make a bunch of gravel paths. Go to the main farm or the uh, the summit farm. Oh, dude, this dude again. Hey, welcome. I'm I'm not even gonna try going through that name again. The first time was hell. Let's see, I thought I saw you got it back at the greenhouse, but I got a bird break. Yeah, I did put put it away, so it's uh, we're all good on that front. Oh, give me, yes, me want, give me the battery packs. Come on, you sexiest. Sexiest or sexist? Alright, let's put the gravel path in. And, um, well, I hope this kind of works. As I'm. Well, oh, that doesn't really work. Not, not really. Uh, I don't like this. I need, like, grass pathways. Oh, okay, it sounded me walking on the gravel. Okay, I was like, wait, what? Why does it sound like I'm still placing it? Uh, get rid of this. Maintain the gravestones. Respect the dead. That kind of thing. Oh, that's right. Um, what's her face has another heart event for nine hearts, I believe. Right? I need to check. All right, let's uh, let's get to the Luna mod page. Try to navigate this website again. 
I much care for needing to go onto the Nexus mod site just to look up information on the character. That's incomplete. All right, and um, all right. Requirements: uh, nine hearts. Say yes to the wizard's question. And in the mailbox. Okay, so I I guess I get a letter. The zoomies on over to bed. What's that? One point four five million. I will eventually get that golden clock. Oh god, I'm so slow. I don't like this. This is horrible. Yeah, tripping hazard. I see the shurikens in there. It's gonna cut an artery. Gotta throw those there. And... No, not that one. This one. Oh, I don't have enough room? Ah, oh, damn it. Let's make room. Under the tower at the earliest convenience. Okay. I'll come out through your basement. Like a good gremlin. Alright, make it progress. If you want to call it that. No, don't be expecting me. No, I want to stay on the other side of this room. Thank you. Oh, you're getting, you're going too close. Why are you stepping on his candles? An amazing discovery. Oh, what could this be? Oh, lovely. This is going in the whole, oh, the main character super special. And how would he know that? He's stalking. What place? No, I don't want to go. You can't make me. I want to stay inside and be a hermit. This is... I don't know about this. Okay. Before we go further, just context. If I understood correctly, Luna was found in the secret woods next to the, um, the pond. I've installed the updated version of Stardew Valley Expanded, which expanded the, the secret woods. This cutscene might break. Ah. Oh. All right, I guess not. Okay. Where wait, where the hell are we? It definitely sounds like the secret woods. Well, this is definitely a pond. It's just the wrong pond. Uh, 
Oh no. I don't like this. Alright, what are those little sparklies down there? You may might feel a little strange. Okay. Um no hate on the guy that made this, because again he made he made Ridside 2. But uh, the lack of the lack of punctuation over here is starting to bother me a bit. Well, the flowers disappeared. It was a success. What, we killed flowers? We've opened a portal to somewhere. I don't like this. I am perfectly capable of handling myself, thank you. I'm a big boy. My mommy told me so. And what, you just gonna run? Okay. Wow. Alright. I think there might be a texture issue right here. That doesn't, that doesn't seem quite right. So music is too happy. He's gonna no. Uh, Magnus, this is something that you would drop everything for. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I'd say that's a pretty good excuse. Why? Well, yes, it is a new world. I have no idea what's going on here. For us, no, you, you go back. Wait, how do we get back to this pond? I think that's a better question. Oh. This early? Yeah, it is pretty early. Oh no, she's stalking too. Question is, how do we get to the pond? How can I lead you to the pond when I don't know how to get there? Oh, there we are. I got some sparkles over here. Sparkles down here. What is it? Where does this go? So long cutscene, actually. Wasn't Luna trying to escape from a bunch of bad guys? It's the whole reason why she ended up in Stardew Valley. The fact that this place is intact is amazing.
Uh-oh. We've been spotted. By a tiny shadow person. Probably to keep it from being broken by other expansions. Yeah, that. But where does it exist at? Uh-oh. There's more humans here. some small undertale vibes outside of space and time probably Oh, lovely drama. I don't want any part of this. Uh-oh. Her neck snapped again. Oh, what the hell? What is this? Why does it look like her clothes are fading away? All right. That's um not much of a setup. Oh, because the main character is special. You know, we wouldn't be having this problem if you just believed her the first time. I am half expecting the uh, the response from like Donkey in the first Shrek movie, where he's gonna accuse Luna of eating her sister. So I I hope it's explained to me why this uh why this village is still intact.
What's... Where are we? What is this candle? Establishing shot much? Oh, okay. I could barely see it down there. Still don't know why she turned the human e uh, into a human either. I think this kind of just... It was like an excuse to... I don't know, date a monster? Oh, well, shadow person. Monster sounds a little insensitive. Don't mind me, I'm just a boy toy. Looks like a large dark blue soccer ball. I really don't like this portrait. I know I've said it at nauseum at this point. I don't like that portrait. Stay with me. Okay, you can stay underneath the floorboards. Okay, now where is this greenhouse that I've been promised? So, what is she, Junimo now? Okay. I still don't know where this portal's at. <laughs> really? Really? Alright, so I guess we're gonna go look around, try to find out where the hell this portal's at. Because it's the biggest mystery here. Where's the portal?
just gonna take a look over to here. Oh, wait a minute. Can I go down here? No? What about over here? Looks like there might be something over here. I don't know. We're just lost. I right, should probably just get that conversation with her out of the way. I would love to. I just don't know how to get there. God damn it. So there's all new people. But, uh, I guess the thing we gotta look for are sparkles. Because if the if the sparkles are meant to be uh, what what do you call it the um, uh, the warp point then a series of sparkles I saw at the beginning of the cutscene on on the southern end of the of the area kind of goes to show that that's that's the place that we got to be we got to find those got to connect to it. All right, so that's back at the these secret woods here. You know, I saw a question while I was doing research on the mod about where the town was. I don't think it was uh, someone asking me or uh, asking the um, the the question of uh, of uh, what's it of. Uh, how to unlock it, it was literally uh, how do you find it? How do you get to it? Where is it at? And I'm not seeing anything. Uh, Alright, where's... Get the phone out. So... How to unlock and visit. Mm, and box uh, no. All right, so it gives me a spoiler for the scene of the the event, and all it is is just the wizard telling me about the uh, the spell. Check the gigantic cauliflower. Yeah, we'll do that in a moment. But yeah, it doesn't it doesn't say how to just naturally get there. Oh wait, I think I saw some comments. I think someone is. Asking the most important question. Like, how do you just visit it normally? Like a normal person. Maybe the real portal to when we was the home run. <laughs> God damn. I agree. Where is it? And for, for the comment here. And it says, before... Uh, the, the response is, before enter a secret forest. What the hell does that mean? You know what? We'll find this portal one way or another. Something magical, yeah, maybe. No, can't take it for myself. If <laughs> I consider it might be all head, I, maybe I'll go up. All right, let's take a look. Okay. Oh, what? It, right here? Oh. Wow, that is pretty dickish.
Yes, it's a port. Wait, we're in another cutscene. Damn it. Wait, these two are from Stardew Valley? Why the hell are they here? Wait, where are these guys from? Are they... Oh, they're sorcerers. Oh, they don't look much like sorcerers. Literally a hole in the fence. Just amazing. Yeah. Well, I would hope I'd be welcome in this place anytime. I worked really hard to get here. And, well, you guys don't exactly have authority to, to tell me if I'm welcome or not. Bianca here asking the important questions. Very nice. Well, I have a god tractor. <laughs> Son of a shitty beards. <laughs> Uh, it could be very easily construed that uh, that these two could be married, but uh, apparently they're brother and sister. So uh, Quinn, have at it. Well, <laughs> I have to move over. God damn. Oh. Alright, that also looks like a lot of forge puzzles. God damn it, another cutscene! I thought they were, but I was 100% gonna be on the home record of that threesome. God damn it. Queen, you worry me a lot. Is the greenhouse right here? No, I don't want to be a part of another cutscene. Come on, give me a break here. Gello? Who the hell's Gello? Is that the teddy bear? I've literally done nothing for you, kid. Okay, this, um, this little shadow person has some pretty violent interests. I approve. Wait, what? How does she know what monster trucks are? Oh, thank God. All right, this is just a set piece. There's 
Stardew Valley expanded all cutscenes 4K 1080p. Oh, I, I just know that there's going to be someone eventually dedicated enough to, to do that. Do every single cutscene for Stardew Valley, Stardew Valley Expanded, Ridgeside, every single mod. Okay. Oh, what are these? Alright, interesting. What's over here? It just looks like a dead end. Lots of forgeables, though. Oh, actually, what is this? A, a sweet gem berry? I mean, that's cool. Is there supposed to be a cutscene here, or do I offer up the sweet gem berry since it's there? Then again, I don't really put a whole lot of faith in the mod maker to um, to clue us in like that. Yeah, no disrespect to him, but uh, you know, it, it, his style is not exactly my taste. So who the hell is? Uh, why do I feel like I'm in the wrong neighborhood? These guys. Miko. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to throw it into the pond, but... Um... Might be a fishing... That too, it could be a fishing spot. Oh, whoa. Who's this? Gallows, all right. The Three Musketeers Jalapeno Edition. <laughs> okay, she's already at two hearts. Or like a two friendship level. Okay, what's it? All right, clipping through it, and I cannot, um, I'm clicking on it, nothing's happening. All right. Oh, wow. Okay. Even. Interesting. Oh, she just sells rare seeds off the cuff. That's very fascinating. All right, try to find a greenhouse. Oh, wow, there's more of them. Renus. Why does it... Looks like he's a really shitty uh, soul patch. And who's this fat bastard? And food. All right, there. I mean, that's nice, but again, punctuation. Punctuation is very important. You have to add the right amount of punctuation. All right, where is? Okay, we got another one here. Are the mines still inhabited? Like the mines in Stardew Valley? Uh, sure. Inhabited. Okay. Whether or not there are people alive over there is kind of up to debate, but okay. Oh. Oh, whoa. This is very interesting. What does this do? It does nothing. Can't interact with that. 
Something about forging too? Can I can I forge stuff? Do you have the no, I guess I don't have the ability to forge. Alright, they alright, talk to that person already. Alright, and it's amazing that they have uh cookware. Just the ability to to make cooked meals. Just like a normal person. There's nothing normal about this place. So I may need to get this mod. <laughs> well, it's going to make you work for it. Alright, nothing of value there. Nothing of value there. Bianca and Raphael go up to 14 hearts. For all intents and purposes, this this seems like it's the closest thing to a greenhouse here, but I can't interact with it. Like, I'm trying to. That's me, that's me mashing the left of uh, the right mouse button. Nothing's happening. Let's see. Uh, I'm assuming it's greenhouse. That's that's what I read before. All right, not doing anything there. All right, let me go back to Nexus mods now. See if there's any. Oh, actually, let me let me pause it. <laughs> Date a girl just to get with someone else's brother. Yeah, that's a, that's a big brain mod to some. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> okay, so features. 50 new events. Uh, lock to explore. Forge new items. New craftables, okay. Toddlers by day 60 have a unique appearance. Interesting. Okay, so they're the locations. The Ancient Lake, uh, Luna's House, Falls Cave, and Diana's Greenhouse, which is unlockable. So I guess I gotta be great friends with uh, little Diana over here. Oh, man, you just... Oh, this makes me mad. All this to to increase my insatiable desire for more farms for my for my ancient fruit business. And this game is putting roadblocks in front of me. All right, let me go back to the guide here. I want to see if I can um I can go into NPC guide. Okay, there's there's Diana. She needs to be at eight hearts for me to use the greenhouse. <sighs> this mod hates me. <laughs> this mod hates me a lot. Guys like mayonnaise, right? Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm not sure that's a good assumption to be making. I gotta go. I gotta go grab the truffles from the piggies. Oh wow, they got me a lot today. 
That's nice. Grab this one. I'm going to hold on to the sweet gem berry. I f just have a feeling I do need to throw something in that pond. This seems like the only logical answer. That's an owl statue right there. I forgot that I have the NPC Adventures mods installed. Alright, let's find the owl statue. There's a lot of farm to check. Oh, alright, there it is. Things are supposed to be really rare, and this is my third owl statue. Looks very fine, yeah. Uh, I gotta do something. Uh, yeah, gotta do something. Got ourselves a tractor, and then we nuke everything. Obviously, the kind you put on sit. What? Applauded. Do you, do you not know how mayonnaise works? You know, the thing that you put on your sandwich? Gives it a little bit of creamy zest? are forgeable out here. That's not right. Whoops. Forgetting to do something. Oops. Why does it have so many pre <laughs> Yeah. I wonder what that greenhouse looks like. That better be a big greenhouse. be the biggest greenhouse I've ever seen. Well, that's helpful. I really don't like that, uh, uh, that spot where all the weeds grow. Oh, hey, we got more. I'm not gonna... Oh, actually, I am going to harvest them right now. And I'm not going to sell them. 
but instead I'm gonna convert them into seeds. Oh, is my is my inventory? Wow, my inventory's full. All right, let's change that. Okay, it's still full. And uh, what else are we gonna get rid of? Okay, the slime. All right, gonna get rid of the slime. Uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure that you probably noticed by now, but Queen doesn't exactly talk. She has constant existential crises. How many of these do I already have? Um, uh, well, let's see. You need the framework mods. That's, that's a requirement for anything that you're trying to install mod wise uh, but after that the only other things that you're gonna need is just the um, the Luna a straight and starter value mod So that, um, you know, it's funny that uh, Queen's going through this this crisis with the with an NPC. It, it reminds me of the the friend I was mentioning at the beginning of the stream. Um, she played Sturdy Valley a bit, but the thing I know her for is when she played um, Fire Emblem Awakening, and she had told me that the the first thing uh, her friend said when she got the game was, "Don't date Crom." Like, that's too generic. Don't date Krom. And she's like, okay, okay. First thing she does is, is date Krom. And everyone's just like, fucking really? Sounds like what Queen's going through. Only it's with characters from Sturdy Valley. Uh, you should have the antisocial NPCs. I believe that is a requirement. Um, when you go on the Nexus, uh, the the Nexus mod page for the the Estrade, it should give you the list of mods that you need. Skyrim with so many mods, I almost can't play it. Oh god, rip. And I, I think the thing I'm so excited for about this uh, this entire situation, if you haven't noticed already, there's been no major uh, hang-ups with the game. Because that uh, the new RAM installed. So, this is freaking awesome. Oh, I have a lot of these. Alright, Queen, don't worry. At the end of the stream, I'll go ahead, look it up, and um, I will send you the um, the required mods. Uh, I'll, like, I'll link the, the mod pages that, that you need for it. Oh, that's right. I was, um, I've got some more, got some more iron bars that need to be smelted. That's right. After this, I am checking the, um, I'm checking Monster Hunter. Uh, world. I want to see how well that game performs. 
I've already checked Minecraft, and I I think it's it's a little bit better, but uh, once Optifine 1.19 releases, I think I can expect uh, better results. I remember watching a video saying one of the biggest issues with Minecraft is that it doesn't utilize the uh, the the computer the way it's supposed to. Oh shit! I just realized I, I left some stuff in um, in one of the chests. I just want... Relax, Queen. I'll take care of it for you. There. Wait. Okay. Five new mods. Oh, someone is complaining a lot today. All because she wants that fire crotch. Doesn't use threads. Okay, that was the thing I was thinking of. It's really dumb. I hate you for this, and I wish they curse of stub toes upon. Oh, it's kind of funny. Cause I um, uh, I saw a post on Reddit where a dude was so pissed. That someone had uh, put, uh, had uh, like taped mustard packets underneath the seat of a toilet. That he wrote a letter on, on the bathroom stall, s wishing him uh, stubbed toes for the rest of his wa life. It was, man, it was it was harsh. He was mad, but then again, I'd be mad too. Why did the requirements? <laughs> Okay, well, we are at the end of the stream anyway, so I, I'm gonna go I'm gonna go take off and make, oh, make the bandit queen's life a little bit easier before her brain melts So uh, we'll be back tomorrow with uh, more witcher stuff. We do DLC and um, When Monday rolls around perhaps it's gonna be a monster on a world day. Who knows? All right. Well tomorrow See you for the witcher, but until then Let's have a great evening. All right. Take it easy.